Hey guys, what's up? I'm super excited to have you back on my channel today. If you don't know me, my name is Veronica. I'm 29 years old and I'm originally from Bavaria. Today I'm going to be talking about the things I like better in the United States than in Germany. Before we start, I just quickly wanted to point out that this is my personal view and I only lived here for a couple of months and I can also only speak for Georgia but it's only a matter of time until we move again so I'm super excited to be able to get to experience a lot more of the United States. Alright, without further ado, let's get started. The first thing I would like to point out is the free soda and water refills you will get in a restaurant. It doesn't matter where you go, it can be a sports bar or even a high class restaurant. And there's no limit on how much you can drink. If there's good customer service, you don't even have to ask for it. In Germany, it's quite different since you will pay for every single drink you order. I've actually heard quite a few times that this is how the restaurant business makes their most sales. So I cannot imagine that this will ever change in Germany. I just find it a little bit easier the way it's done here in America than it is in Germany simply because you have a little bit more flexibility and I kind of find it a little bit more transparent. In America it doesn't matter for how many people you book the room for. There might be a limit how many people you can actually have in your room but for the most part it doesn't matter if you're two, three or maybe even four people in one room. Whereas in Germany the price will actually depend on how many people you book the room for. Customer service in America is top notch. Even though we do say the same thing in Germany, customer's king, it does not apply the same way at all. It is so much different here in the States. I feel like the people who work in customer service in America put a lot more effort in their friendliness. And that might have something to do that in Germany, the laws about employment are so much stricter. It's a lot harder to get fired in Germany. So maybe that's why German customer service employees don't care that much and don't try as hard. But I really do like the American way better whether it's honest and sincere or not. It's just really nice to be treated well as a customer. In Germany, we actually have another saying, Service Wüste Deutschland, which pretty much means Germany, the desert of customer service. And yes, that's what we're saying about our own customer service. So don't ever feel bad for ranting about customer service in Germany. It's really not that good. And we know that. Houses in Germany versus houses in America. Overall, I just really like the American style. The way the houses look on the outside, I think it's kind of cute. And then also some particular things on the inside. The first one is the bathroom attached to the master bedroom. In America, that's just a standard, whereas in Germany, it's not very common. I guess the way Germans would think about that, it's kind of a waste of that room because only the parents who sleep in the master bedroom are gonna use it, but I really do enjoy having the bathroom attached to the bedroom. And the second thing are the built-in and walk-in closets. In Germany, you will find an extra piece of furniture for your jackets and your shoes and your clothes. Whereas in America, you will find the built-in and walk-in closets as a standard. I think even if you live in the cheapest apartment, it will most likely gonna have a built-in closet and you don't need to buy something for that particular home. I really enjoy that because it makes your life a little easier. When you move, you don't have to worry about if my closet is gonna fit in the new home. The yellow lines marking the center of the road indicating in which direction the traffic goes. That really helped me a lot, especially in the very beginning when I first got here. In America, there are so many big roads with multiple lanes. I knew that if I was on the right side of the yellow line that I was going in the right direction. Last but not least, it's probably one of the most iconic American things. There's no particular reason why I like them better than the German ones. I just think they look really cool and I don't know, they just remind me of America. I have another question for you guys today. Either if you're American, have you been in Germany? Or if you're German, have you been in America and can relate to any of the things I've mentioned in this video? Why I like them so much better? Or how do you feel about it? Let me know in the comments below. Alright guys, that's already it for the first video. Next week I'm gonna be talking about the biggest differences in American and German houses. I've already mentioned some in this video, but if you'd like to hear more, make sure to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And I thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next week. Bye! My name is Veronica, I'm originally...
we will be moving in the future, so... A bathroom attached to the med... med room.